Hey everyone, it's Sarah Jane with Chic on the Cheap. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you so many things you can do with this $1 solar snake light that you can get year after year at the Dollar Tree. We'll start with the most common hack you'll see here on YouTube. You basically just take a mason jar and remove the middle disc on the lid, and then you simply remove the light from its stake, and then push it through the open portion of the lid so that it looks like this, and then screw the lid back onto the jar. You can leave it as a simple lantern like this or add some stones. My favorite are the blue ones that you can get at the Dollar Tree. I put two packs inside this jar, and here is the result. And if you do like a lot of color in your garden or on your porch, pick up some of these vases from the Dollar Tree. The lights fit right on top. And just a tip, you can make these vases and all of the other items I share in this video truly waterproof by putting them together using a permanent glue like E6000. It's not necessary, but it will make a big difference. And here's what the purple and pink vases look like at night. They truly are so bright. And because the camera is not doing them justice, I took a picture to show you more of what they look like in person. The Dollar Tree also sells these frosted color vases and the lights sit perfectly on top of those two. And here's what they look like, just so vibrant and fun and perfect for a patio or an outdoor pool or even as a way to decorate your tailgate in your school or teens colors. Now, if you're like me, you have lots of Dollar Tree candles, reuse or recycle the containers by melting and pouring out the old wax, and then take the top portion of the light, which twists off easily, and set it on top of the containers like this. They make really awesome little accent lights, and if your patio or deck has stairs, you could line them with these. Or maybe you want some clear lighting. The top of these lights fit right on top of these glass tea light holders too. and also on top of the raised tea light holders as well. Next is one of my favorite outdoor lighting ideas. I just took this really pretty Dollar Tree jar and pushed the solar light down into it like this. And you won't need any glue for this option. That light is not going anywhere. <laughs> and it just creates the most beautiful lighting and leaves a snowflake pattern on whatever kind of surface it's on. Now let's say there's a jar or container you really like, but the lid is too large. Just carefully cut a hole in the top. Usually the lids on Dollar Tree jars like this one are pretty easy to cut through. And once you have a hole that is wide enough, you can slide the light into it and screw the lid back on. And just like that, you can take a really pretty jar and turn it into a gorgeous piece of outdoor lighting. You can also do this with clear or frosted plastic containers like this one from the Dollar Tree. I just used a utility knife and a handy lighter to create a hot blade to cut a hole through the lid. After I was done creating the opening, I put the solar light through it, and this is an easy way to make a camping or an emergency lantern, and you could also just draw on it or put numbers on it to mark your address at night for visitors, or my personal favorite, just put a pumpkin face on it to decorate your porch for Halloween. Next, you can pick up this candle holder from the Dollar Tree and put the light on top. It's another perfect fit. And just leave it like that for a cool effect. Or you can glue it to the original stake. I would recommend letting it dry upside down like this to give your solar light a chic makeover. And the result is a beautiful and whimsical $2 hack. Next is another one of my favorite outdoor lighting ideas using this Dollar Tree candle holder with a handle. Just hang it from one of the Dollar Tree's yard hooks and for only $3, it looks so high end in the day or nighttime and it also puts out a gorgeous pattern on the ground. 
Next is an easy solar steak idea if you're looking for something taller. You can pick up this pan that comes with a long handle at the Dollar Tree and just pull off the end with a hanger. It's really easy to do and slide the solar light into the opening. Then you take the other end of the handle that looks like this and put it in the ground so that you have a $2 solar steak light that is almost three feet tall. And the last hack or idea that I want to share with you involves these shower curtain rings from the Dollar Tree. Now I'm using this cutting board for demonstration purposes only, but you can attach the ring to any surface that needs nighttime lighting and the solar light fits right inside like this. Just attach the ring to wherever you need nighttime lighting, like along a fence, on a shed, or by a door, and then add the solar light. All right, guys, well, those are my $1 solar light hacks. And the truth is, it seems like there are an endless amount of things you can do with these lights and an endless amount of Dollar Tree items they fit in. I'm trying to show a few more options now, but I hope I've inspired you to add a little light to your porch or yard for the spring, summer, and throughout the year. As always, thank you so much for watching. And until my next video, I'll see you then.